from Nancy to Freddie. How many years has it been since I burned skin to stay awake, to keep from sleep in you? The nightmare ended a lifetime ago. My bed is no longer a fist of knives, and yet at times I miss the threat and tingle along my spine, the hero you made of me. But now, without you, my monster, why am I? I drink soy decaf lattes with girlfriends gossiping over Instagram posts and Twitter feeds. I have too much red wine with dinner, enough to promise I fall fast asleep. I don't dream. Remember the boiler room? How you chase me, a ballet of flames reflecting in your eyes, your blistered face, a bouquet of scars, your smile, a snake. How do I get back there? I want to feel fear in my mouth again, swallow its electricity until I glow courage. Give me your cackle and taunts, your wolf's breath at my door. I'll huff and puff. Play me a song of razors scraping metal pipes like the strumming of synthesized guitar. I need a soundtrack for my comeback, something that builds and builds and builds. God, I am so bored these days. I swipe right for every man in a striped sweater, hoping their fingers on my flesh are just as sharp as yours. When I ask if in their bedroom they hide a furnace that I can fight my way out of, I am disappointed when they always say no, relieved when they never call again. Don't you feel it's about time for a sequel? I think tonight I'll brew a pot of dark roast and draw myself a hot bath. I'll let down my guard, enough to make things interesting. I can see it now, the struggle to stay alert that only pulls one closer to sleep. The drip and sizzle, your hand creeping out of the water like a secret. The faint hum of children singing a lullaby. One, two, Freddy's coming for 